hit the subscribe button right now and let's embark on this journey together. Have you ever wondered how we can check the accuracy of these calculations? These are very big numbers and we can calculate their multiplications, but whether it is accurate or not. So here is your answer, how we can do that with the help of Vedic mathematics. So I will teach it by this example. What we are going to do is it is called the digit sum method. What do I mean by that is find the digit of uh, digit sum of this numbers. Digit sum means five plus six plus eight plus nine. What will happen is nine. Uh, here's one more tip. Nine you can omit whenever you are calculating digits on nine, you can omit. So it is 11 plus eight. It is 19. 19 is one plus nine is equals to 10. 10 is equals to one plus zero is one. So it's digit sum is one. So let's calculate this digit sum two. The digit sum of 264 is two, six plus four, 10, 12 plus three. So it is three. Now calculate the digit sum of this digit this number 1 plus 5 plus 0 plus 1 plus 8 plus 9 plus 6 9 we can omit 1 plus 8 is also 9 we can omit so 6 plus 1 is 7 and 7 plus 5 is so 7 plus 5 is 12 and 12 1 plus 2 is 3 so its digit sum is also 3 now 1 into 3 equals to 3. You can find the relation. Digit sum means the digit sum also follows the calculation. Just like that, you can apply this on every calculation. In, multi in addition also, you can see the digit sum of this number is 8. Digit sum of this number is 9. 8 plus 9 is how much? 9 you can also omit, so 8. 8 minus 6 is 2. Digit sum of this number is 2. Same will happen in divide. So 3 divided by 5 is 0.6. And the uh, digit sum of this number is 3, 5 and 6. Okay. So that's how you can calculate. Please subscribe to show support. Thank you very much.